Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite, and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, ooh, ooh. my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you so much um, for taking the time out to watch my videos, letting me know that they resonate with you. And, you know, we're all on the same path and spiritually connected in one way or another. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Also, if, you, uh, if you're comfortable enough, please drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video. Or... If it's about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. Also, if you um, feel like the video is being very informative to you or just gave you good vibes, you would love to share with a loved one, family, friend, or even a fellow impact that are going through some dark times right now and they need, you know, validation for things, please go ahead and share. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. And once again, thank you so much for the love and support. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. Y'all, this daggone, um... Uh, oh my goodness. Um, the, <laughs> the meditation I'm listening to, it got my hair standing on end. I don't know what it is, but um, uh, the, the vibration I'm feeling from the back of my, my spine and right here. So, if you're feeling any chills listening to this in the background, um, you know the reason why. Uh, it's called Earth, uh, Healing Earth Six Hours of Deep Prayer Healing Music relaxing mind body and soul meditation music and i will post this link in the description box below it's really been helping me i've been finding some really good meditation music and it's like if i'm connected with y'all like on um facebook messenger and stuff like that i always try to send everybody um like these powerful meditations because you know we, we really need to meditate when we try to find time you know you have to find time i know i understand a lot of people are busy but you need to find time to be able to release so you can like recycle those those vibes that are coming out especially if they're all crazy and got you in balance um but today my video is about twin flame 101 hey Opus, uh seeing the hidden language like never before it's like since we've been activated it's like we're seeing things like with a fresh new pair of eyes um i feel like i'm talking through the 5d right now because it's just like i'm seeing things like in a different way um, I'm communicating with animals in a different way like they're more gravitating towards me like the ones I tell you I have outside my house you know if you've been with me for a while you've probably even seen pictures of me showing y'all um, pictures of the cats that I got outside my house I got like about 10 or 11 cats outside I said I never thought I was gonna be like cat lady or whatever because <laughs> when you think about a cat lady you think about an old lady that got all these cats but it's like you know um, I've been feeding them for so long and I spoil them to death like they're you know they're my my children so um it, it's like since the activation and going through different things and elevating and evolving you're probably seeing things in a different manner um like a lot of y'all been going through spiritual awakenings and you know we've been losing jobs left and right and probably can't find jobs because i haven't found a job and this is like my whole after a whole year and a half you know i've been putting um uh what is it um uh, applications in but it just seems like you know I'm not getting called back or if I go to interviews I'm not getting called back but it's just like because it's not on the level that you know you're trying to do it just to survive but not something that connects with your your spiritual gifts so you're not able to get it because it's wanting you to like do things on your own or at least go towards something that gravitates towards your gifts because you know a lot of um, I, I know a few of y'all contacted me and say hey Roz I'm going through the same thing too I have not found a job it's because universe wants you to find something that gravitates more towards your gift that's the reason why it's not working but they're you know by the powers that be they're making sure that you're well taken care of while you're going through this situation because I know you're like I need a job I need things you know I need to be able to take care of myself financially you know it's like blessings my way you know that uh, my ex helps take care of me and it's just like a blessing even though I hate doing that because I'm the type of person I like to make my own money and I'm very independent but it's just like since I've been going through all these crazy things 
you know I've been just making these videos and it's just like I've been putting in applications and everything like that but you know universe make it see fit that I'm taken care of um, in that way so you know those blessings it comes in handy but it's just a lot of us are going through these different things and seeing things for what they truly are seeing people how they truly are just looking at the world in general and seeing the things that need to be taken care of uh, more people are grab coming towards your way they're needing assistance um you know probably you, you've probably been used to people coming up and telling you their whole life story like Ross, a lot of you telling me stuff like that and i was just like because you're that empath they they're coming to you for help, you know, and it, it makes me feel good, especially when I'm down and out, you know, if it's like somebody I know that's not trying to take advantage, because it's just like some people I see, you know, going through the store, going to the store, and they try to solicit you and try to, you know, because it, it just seems like we attract those type of people, like, oh, that, that's that person, they'll give me some money, and, you know, knowing they're using it for, like, cigarettes or drugs or something like that, I won't help, you know, I, I don't feel bad when I tell them no, but, you know, um, if it's somebody that I truly know that's in need, I, it's like I can tell those type of people between the ones that are just, you know, trying to solicit, um, being able to help people in that way, being, you know, even if it's like just giving them kind words, it's like, you know, people I connect with on different levels, like, you know, on email, via email or messenger, I ch try to always send them um, positive positive you know affirm you know positive assurance basically because we go through tough times you never know what somebody's going through at that time they could be having a bad day and just little kind words to let them know you're like becoming that person's guardian angel you're sending those blessings towards them let them know hey you know as long as you're doing your part you know the universe is going to help you out um getting the things that you need uh you could be going through you know separation with family and friends you could be going through separation of a uh you know a significant other or just going through things financially that you know you get stressed out about but it's just like blessings comes your way that you know things are being met or you know you're going through a tough time right now and then things are starting to change over for you so it's just like a lot of us are seeing things the hidden language it's not hidden language like i'm talking about work uh verbatim uh you know talking in a different language but it's just like seeing things and that was always hidden to you weren't able to see them like you're seeing them now um being able to see you know if you're at a job that you're miserable at you can tell this is not you know positively serving you in that good light you know um it's trying to tick you to go towards things that gravitate towards you that on that level where you need to be at or it has you searching for things for you to be able to do things that it doesn't seem like it's a career to you like with my videos you know yeah I might not be able to do them every day like I used to because I miss being able to do them like doing four or five videos a day and then turn around and doing live you know but it's just like the way they got me set up I'll do like nine or ten videos that day and then I need to take a rest or sometimes I can go the next day and do some more videos um and it's a true blessing to be able to do that but it's just like you know I keep telling y'all so I'm gonna start my live up but you know when universe is ready for me to do that I'm just say that when universe is ready for me to do you know live feed again because I like doing that where you know we all get together and we talk about the things that we struggle with and we're trying to find answers to it so I'm I really do miss live but you know, I might start it up again. I might not. I don't know. I said I wanted to, but it's just all in divine time and when they want me to do things the way they want me to do them. Because after now I'm doing, you know, before I used to do like four videos a day. Now I'm doing like around six to nine videos. And then I take a day's rest or the next day if I feel an urge to do it, I'll just go ahead and do another urge. I mean, um, do push out some more videos and you know to be able to help people out it's just the way they got me set up now it's like i get drained because i'm putting so many vibes and so many vibe you know putting so many vibrations and so many energies towards y'all because it's just like we all need that in our life we're going through different things and just need to have that reassurance that you know things are going to get better for us I don't know when I said that. It was like a chill came down. <laughs> it was like, ah! This, this meditation music got me having chills, like chills going down my back and then coming out my arms. So, um, it's a beautiful thing to actually go through these things. Like I said before, you if you've been with me for a while, um, 
you probably see, feeling the change in my energy. And, and I mean, it really feels good. I love it when I'm like this, you know, so I can be able to share it with other people. This is a beautiful feeling to be able to feel a lot of love coming towards your way. And, you know, we're going through through tough times and just really need that positive confirmation that things are going to be okay and if you need that this is it now um you're going through things like this for a reason it's making you filter out all the hard times all the bad karma that you have had that you're releasing because like i said um before this is our last time going through the karmatic cycles um through generational curses because it might be very intense for you this moment in time this lifetime is very intense for you so with you going through these things that's the reason why things are so hard right now because you have gone through so many things in life and you know this they told you before you came back into this life there was a lot of hard times that you're going to go through so this time is going to be the most roughest thing you have actually gone through in this life so that's the reason why things are the way they are right now so if you're needing that reassurance this is it um it is just like being able to see things in a different way even though sometimes we might go through tough times it's all right because you know you're going through these times it's like really hellish so knowing you're going through this for a reason it is happening for a reason but it's just like you know not every day is going to be perfect but this is the lifetime this lifetime that you're having is supposed to be the most intense one from what they're telling me that um you had to go through just for you to be able to realize a whole lot of things that you're going to do a lot of help self-healing that you've been trying to do in your different past lives that you weren't able to get and connect with before so they're making you deal with everything from the past life and this life all at one time so it might be you know <laughs> very crazy but knowing this is the reason why so I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. If you have, drop me a line. I want to know if you resonate with this video. If you've been feeling like you're seeing things in a different way. It has you doing more, uh, making you step out your comfort zone. This is the time that they're making you step out your comfort zone. I'm seeing some of my, my love bugs that are, you know, uh, YouTubers. And, you know, I've been sending them positive effort, you know, you know confirmation you know you're doing a good job you know if you haven't been doing it for a while and things are starting off slow it's okay you keep at it you know you don't expect you know if it's a blessing if you got about 10 or 15 people to come at you yeah even though it might be 10 or 15 people those 10 or 15 people you're helping out in, in big ways to where it carries over and it end up being you know next week it end up being 20 people and you know so on and so on and so on so you know if you're going through different crazy things right now, no one is for a good reason, but they're having you look at things in a totally different direction. I know I feel so euphoric right now. <laughs> so I'm like, whoa, what is this feeling? But, you know, better days are coming for you. Um, I know I got emotional earlier, and I hope I did all my kumbaya yas because that, I mean, that really put me in an emotional state of mind. But it was like beautiful emotions, like when you can cry tears of joy just to let you know that you're doing a good job and you know better days are coming and even though sometimes you might be handed a plate of negative vibrations you know um the strongest ones go through the toughest times so just remember that so like and subscribe hit that notification bell drop me a line i would love a chance to hear from you um hit that notification button you know share the video and also give me a thumbs up and you know drop me a line so i can give you a post notification shout out uh i'm gonna give a post notification shout out to uh let me see mandy much love to you um sydney and bam bam and uh worst nero and tracy borden and bear and rainbow much love to you and i will see you on my next video much love send out as much love and light positivity as you possibly can know that you are truly blessed highly favored and forever loved and knowing there's always someone out there praying for your better days so i pray for y'all each and every day so much love to you peace and be wild